I do think it's fair to say that voting for this is supporting the national health care reform provisions for taxpayers. Absolutely. Um, but I but I would hope that the committee would be able to set aside. <laughs> I would hope the committee would be able to set aside, you know, that that far left, far right ideology and get into the wars on this stuff. This really, these provisions, as the chair stated, are tax cuts for Minnesota. <coughs> so, you know, if if folks don't support those, that's, that's certainly understandable. There'd be many people in the legislature who would argue we can't afford tax cuts right now. Others who would say we should pass on these tax cuts. The history of tax conformity in Minnesota has generally been pretty silent on the politics. And, and I will, for example, tell you that I am carrying a, a conformity bill that I hope the chair will hear that will conform to the Bush tax cuts. And you know we may have some members on either side of the aisle who say we can't afford to pass on those Bush tax cuts. Uh, I'm authoring that bill. Uh, it will cost Minnesotans money, but mi legislators will have to choose. Do they want to give tax cuts to Minnesotans that were just passed by Congress or not? We don't have to. We can have folks add that back in on the Minnesota side. So the rhetoric can heat up in this stuff pretty fast. Uh, generally, you see both parties have tried to do conformity where it's affordable. 